Yeah. What's going on, y'all? It's Jamal Rich of More Than Stats, and I'm here with luxury sportswear designer Don C. How you doing, Don? I'm real good. Happy to be here. We're here checking out your latest collection here with Wendy's for NCAA March Madness, am I correct? Correct, yep. We were right here at the Twitter offices in New York and we just debuted some of the pieces that I designed for Wendy's for the tournament. How did you get involved as far as like from a collaboration aspect with Wendy's? My buddy Matt, he knew some people at an agency that control Wendy's business and they plugged it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's it. I'm super hyped. Wendy's gave us the call like uh, because it's a dope, iconic brand and it brought a good memories back for me working on this project. And as far as with the project, uh, inspiration wise, where did you get your inspiration to come up with pieces like this one we see right here? Um, always like basketball. Um, my dad, he exposed me to basketball from infancy. So I've just always been exposed to like different uniforms. I always pay attention to the detail of the garments that they wear on and off the court uh, basketball players. So, uh, you know, with this, I tried to bring a nod back to the pinstripe style because I thought it was uh, the inspiration came from the uniforms of the employees during the early days of Wendy's um, where they wore the blue and white stripes. And I just try to bring that like swag to the pinstripes on the court. And um, and then the basketball is also like the blue and white stripe ball to kind of bring a reference to that Wendy's uh, old retro uniforms. Okay. And, and I was told this is one of your favorite pieces, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. this is the, my favorite piece in the collection of jersey because I think it's just fresh. It looks really cool. And, no pun intended, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> pun intended, actually. And uh, it, uh, yeah, it doesn't even have to say the word fresh. And I thought it, it exudes that and it gives off. Uh, I thought it represents the brand very well. It messages the brand, but it also messages like a cool sports item. So I'm very happy with the outcome. And how long did it kind of take to, to complete this collection? We did it in like 48 hours. No, I'm joking. Oh, I was it was 72 that. hours. No, I'm joking. It was very quick. Um, from the basis in which I worked on the collection, just a couple weeks. And from um, inception to create, that's why I had to lean heavy on the Ketchum and Wendy's teams because they gave me a lot of insight that I needed to be able to like kind of fast track this process. Uh, um, because I always say design is a very um, psychological thing where you have to think about how people are going to react to what they see. So we had a lot of hours spent on thinking about how people would react, thinking about how what people would think. And um, I'm happy with the outcome. But we did it. We fast tracked it. We did this whole project in just a few weeks. What is it about hats that you love so much? Um, well, I did have a hat game on lock. I let go of the hat game because I just got bored a little bit. It was like too many people copying and then it lost my, um, yeah, I just wasn't as excited about it when I was just seeing so diluted, so much copycat product out there. But um, I still know that I have a lot of ideas I could bring to headwear, so I'm just gonna continue to do so. I just got sidetracked to start doing shorts because I was sick of people copying my hats. Now I'm sick of people copying my shorts, so I'm gonna stop doing shorts too. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for your time, Thank Don. you very much. All right, brother. It.